Hi guys, this is James from Six Gamers. Hope you're having a wonderful evening, afternoon, morning, whatever time of day it is for you. I have a headache at the moment, so I've had better evenings. And I've also had worse evenings as well. Just recording this vlog to keep you guys up to date with what's going on on the channel. So this Sunday, I'll be going away to the States uh, to visit my fiance. So I'll be gone around a week. So during that time, obviously, content won't be going up on the channel because I'm not here where I can actually make content. I really did want to try getting a lore of the cards out before I went, but the episode that I've been making has taken longer than I wanted, which has irritated me a little bit because I really was aiming to get the lore of the cards out once a week or as close to once a week as possible. I'm doing it in a slightly different format this episode. So it's one episode split into two halves. So the first half is going to be Lore of the Cards, where you get all your lore information on Alderman, which is coming up. But because Alderman's a dungeon, I thought, hey, why not combine it with Three Musketeers, this particular episode? So you have a lore section, and then you have a section of us running the dungeon and behaving like complete knobheads. If you want to just watch the lore, you can. It's at the beginning, and then as soon as you hear our irritating voices, you can just go and watch something else and spend your time doing something better. As a result, that does kind of increase the time that it takes to create the episode because the three musketeers runs about an hour and a half of content i've been trying to cut down to about 20 30 minutes i could have rushed it out within the next couple of days maybe but i do actually want it to be a good video rather than a pile of toss that i just whack up onto the internet i do currently have a three musketeers episode kind of uploaded to youtube but i need to do all of the crediting and that kind of stuff all that good stuff but if you guys want to see it tomorrow just let me know in the comments and i'll look to try and get that done before i pack my bags and go away basically something else that's also been slowing me down is i have been working on a secret project now i can't really say anything about said secret project it may not even go ahead so i do have to keep my lips sealed about it i'm afraid I would love to tell you guys, and as soon as I am able to tell you guys, I will tell you straight away and let you know about it. Some of you that follow the channel on Twitter may have also realised that I've got myself involved with another little project, but don't worry, most of the time is still going on the channel pretty much every evening. We just do this every couple of Sundays or so uh, for half the day. Uh, it's a music project, so that's awesome. And I like to do metal vocals, for those of you that don't know. My main inspirations are Maynard James Keenan from Tool, Howard Jones, ex-Skill Switch Engage and now Devil You Know, uh, Daniel Gildenlow from Pain of Salvation, and Chad Gray from Mudvayne. Uh, however, this sort of project is a lot softer metal than I usually do. I usually, with um, other people, do sort of tech metal and more kind of middle of the road, machine head heavy. I'd say metal, though I do listen to a little bit of death every now and then. Um, I'd say this project sounds more like sort of a Skylit Drive musically, uh, who I quite like, uh, and with those older kind of vocal styles of the new metal genre, so um, kind of Chad Gray from Mudvayne and Jonathan Davies from Korn, that kind of thing. Uh, either way, if you could listen to it and let me know what you thought of it, that would be awesome if you do want to check it out it's in the description below and I'll probably play a little bit of it during this video so you can get a basic idea of it and then go check out the full track there otherwise I think that's everything I wanted to talk about for now if you have any questions for me please don't hesitate to ask in the comments section as soon as I get back from America I will be straight on finishing off Alderman thank you so much guys for your support it it's mind-boggling, really. I know in comparison to other YouTube channels, this one's not big, but it means so much to me to share a passion for lore with other people that they're on board with. Um, you can't really get too much better than that. So thank you. And until next time, happy hearthstoning. I'll see you for more Lore of the Cards.